electronic. If you've ever seen a vampire movie or some place where the mist seemed to hold onto the ground, lays really low, that type of smoke comes not from aerosolized propylene glycol, not from the product of combustion. In fact, this smoke comes from the opposite of fire. This smoke is made with ice, specifically large chunks of dry ice, frozen carbon dioxide sitting on top of a bath of hot water. We flush that water over the carbon dioxide and it sublimates and creates this really awesome vampire fog. Oh yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah. That is very cool, but Adam, I'm gonna have to stop you inside of the theater. Would you guys like some CO2? <laughs>
and then waves form around the outside of that sheet, and then those waves become droplets, and only two things affect the number of drops produced, the surface tension of the liquid and the size of the colliding surfaces. So if you want to jump in a puddle and make more drops, don't jump with more force. That won't change it. Instead, put on bigger boots. Also, if you're a kid and you want to make bigger messes, don't worry. Just wait. As you grow up, your hands will get bigger and you'll make more drops. Totally true. I make bigger messes now than I ever could have dreamed of as a child. It's physics. That's totally awesome. One of the coolest parts about writing a show like this, and we have a lot of experience, both Michael and I, writing into stuff we don't previously know about until we learn enough to explain it. But one of the problems is once you learn it, it's hard to remember what it was like to not know it. But the not knowing, the beginner's mind, is really important to be able to go back to explaining it. It's perhaps the biggest challenge. That reminds me, I have a challenge for you. Okay. Okay, help me with this table. Sure. Perfect. All right, now this case is full of bottles. Could you grab the stand? Oh, yeah. All right. I'm going to find a suitable bottle in here, and I want you to stand a little further away. Further. Awesome. Okay. Now, Adam, from where you're standing, I want you to knock this bottle over using only air. I'd rather you just comb my hair. 
does it taste like? It's weirdly sweet. <laughs> it's, by the way, that's the same stuff you're vaping, so enjoy that, hipsters. <laughs> that went way too fast for me to either see what was going on or uh, dodge it. Right. Uh, I want to make a slower <laughs> vortex, so I built a larger cannon. <laughs> I don't know can. It's just a hole in the front yeah, yeah. and some plastic in the back. Would you fire? I would love to. Okay, I'm gonna give you some smoke. You're ready, Earth. You're ready. Okay, do it. <laughs> yep. Thank you. 